I'm Rob Woodfield with the Orange County Register, and welcome to OCN2 for Tuesday, March 4th. California gas prices are going up and getting close to record marks set last year. The average price for a gallon of regular gas in California has reached $3.45. In Orange County, the price is $3.41, up 40 cents from a month ago. The local record is $3.47 set last fall. The County Board of Supervisors will meet this morning to debate Orange County's search for a new sheriff. An executive management company has been conducting a search for candidates, and as of now, there are at least 12 in the running, including Assistant Sheriff Acting as Sheriff Jack Anderson. The board has decided to interview the candidates in public, but they'll discuss today issues such as whether the candidates should all be interviewed and whether the public should be able to ask the candidates questions. Currently, the timeline for finding a replacement sheriff has the candidates selected and on the job in June. Hundreds of local teens took to the streets to pay their respects to a 15-year-old boy who was shot and killed at a Fullerton bus stop. The students marched two and a half miles from Fullerton Union High School to the site of the shooting at Brookhurst and Commonwealth. Police say Tariq Cephas was shot by 23-year-old Jose Peralta after the two got into an argument. During yesterday's march, friends of Cephas called for peace and an end to gangs. Several flood control projects in Orange County are the result of a natural disaster that happened 70 years ago this week. This week in 1938, at least 50 people died and thousands lost their homes when 22 inches of rain sent water from the Santa Ana River through Placentia and surrounding cities. The flood became known as the county's biggest natural disaster and spurred actions such as lining Coyote Creek with concrete and the Prado Dam. And it seems Orange County residents are split on the idea of adding Orange County to John Wayne Airport's official title. Tourism leaders want to rename the airport to make it more recognizable and to cash in on the county's fame. Wayne's son has spoken out opposed to the idea. Input from locals and tourists argue both sides. A name change would require approval by county supervisors. Weekdays, watch Daybreak OC from 6 to 8 a.m. on KDOC and catch Real Orange weekday evenings at 6.30 on KOCE. To read more about all of these stories and to get your breaking news all day, click on OCRegister.com.